Hey there! Welcome back to our Snobbier Email Deliverability Challenge Month. I'm Xenia and today we'll continue our exploration of the domain records you need to set up to succeed in email deliverability. Today's topic, setting up the all-important DKIM record. A DKIM record in your domain settings as a digital signature to emails you send from your domain. It's a common email authentication method mailbox providers use to verify that your emails are genuine and haven't been tampered with. Today, I'll guide you through its setup using Namechip and G Suite. But if you're using another provider, the fundamentals are often quite similar. So let's begin. First, navigate to your email provider admin settings. In our case, it's the Google admin account. Within the admin console, select menu and choose apps from the drop down menu. From there, select Google Workspace, followed by Gmail. Then go to the Authenticate Email tab and click Generate New Record. This action will produce a text record name and value for you. With this information ready, log into your Namecheap account. Click Manage the Correspondent Domain, then head into the Advanced DNS settings. Here, select New Record and choose Text Record. Now it's time to add the DKIM parameters to a newly created record. There is a handy list of DKIM names for popular ESPs in the video description. Simply copy the DNS host name or tax record name from the Google Admin account and paste it into the corresponding host field in main chip. Repeat this action with the tax record value, pasted it into the value field. Once done, ensure you confirm your entries by clicking the check button. A small but crucial detail to remember. In Namecheap, when inputting the host field, don't include the actual domain name. So far, an entry like only include. And that's it. You're now one step closer to perfect email deliverability. See you.